Hello everyone, Nathan Sivu here. Uh, so I wanted to talk a little bit about the uh, the hashtag YouTube down that uh, occurred the other night. Uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, late in the middle of the night, well, at least it was late for me in my time zone, uh, YouTube was down globally for um, about, about an hour, maybe slightly more. I'm not exactly sure what the amount of time was. Um, they didn't exactly give an explanation as to why it happened, but they, they said, you know, we're aware of the problem and we're fixing it. And uh, eventually it did get fixed, obviously. Um, so I myself am a web developer, and I don't find it particularly disturbing that the site went down, you know, in and of itself. Um, it, it has been a really long time since it went down for that length of time, especially globally. Um, actually, I'm not even sure if it has happened. Um, so yeah, I don't find it disturbing that it went down, but what I do find it distur disturbing uh, a bit is that they... Um, they weren't, they're not, they didn't exactly tell us why. To, to my knowledge, at this point, they still haven't told us what the original problem was. And, I mean, assumably they know. Um, I mean, I th it, it could have been anything from, you know, a disgruntled employee who wanted to get back at them or, uh, or, just, or just human error. I mean, I, I've, prob I've got my money on pro probably just human error. Like, they, they tried to push an update and it didn't work out so well. And whoops, they had to figure out what the problem was. Um... I actually found it kind of funny, you know, some people online were freaking out, like, oh my god, what's happening? What, what are we going to do with our YouTube? It's just like, well, you know, there's more to life than YouTube. Um, in fact, I actually used it to uh, shamelessly promote um, uh, my BitChute channel and my BitTube channel, which kind of brings me to the, uh, kind of the point of this video. Um, so, for those of you who don't know, uh, I also post my videos on a number of other sites. I also post uh, on uh, BitChute and BitTube. Uh, there, there are a couple of alt tech sites um, that uh, there, there, there are other video platforms that uh, I think uh, stand a very good chance of being, you know, legitimate YouTube competitors. Especially BitChute. BitChute's been around around for uh, a long time, and they're, they're both free speech platforms, by the way. So you're not going to get banned for you know whatever you say or, or do on there. So which which is great. I think that's the way it should be. Um, yeah, these are fantastic platforms. So, um, uh, what's what's great about um, uh, about some of these platforms, like like Bitchute. Uh, Bitchute is a free speech platform, and uh, one of the, one of the things that I really like about it is that you just you put in your YouTube ID into the settings, and then it'll automatically port whatever videos you publish live on your YouTube channel. Uh, give it about an hour or so; it'll be live on uh, on Bitchute, which I think is fantastic. And actually, of, of all the platforms, I actually get more engagement on there than any other. Like, I get way more views than uh, than that or BitTube. Actually, actually, probably more than BitTube. Actually, probably more than YouTube and BitTube combined. I get more uh, get more views on uh, BitChute. Um, yeah, it's it's a great platform, and I, I would highly recommend uh, that people you know sign up to these these platforms. And if you're a creator, to upload to these platforms. Uh, to any of the platforms that I mentioned in this video. And, uh, and of course, the, the neat thing about BitTube is that you earn cryptocurrency by watching other people's videos, and then you as the viewer, uh, sorry, you as the creator, the uploader, you get um, you get cryptocurrency um, when uh, while they're watching your videos. It's all, it's all based on, on watch time. They call it airtime, actually. It's, uh, it's a pretty neat little system. Um... I'm also technically on DTube, although I haven't uh, I haven't given them uh, a lot of love lately. I they, to be honest, the site kind of bugs me because it's 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 a little bit buggy to be quite honest. But uh, I don't know. I might give them a second chance. What I might end up doing is uh, see the the problem with with DTube. The, the biggest problem for me is that you can't uh, you can't have your videos unlisted or private when you first upload them. Like once you upload them, that's it. They're live. They're out there. Well, that doesn't just doesn't really work for me so well. Like I typically upload my videos in bulk and then have, you know, have them set for timed release. Um, so, uh, yeah, what I might end up doing is just, you know, while I'm uploading them in bulk, at the same time, I'll start uploading a bit to DTube at the same time. So that'll actually kind of be like the early access platform in a way. Um, yeah, I mean, some people swear by DTube. Some people, some people just love the platform. And... It's kind of a neat idea. The, the, uh, it also has a crypto monetization system. The, it, it's, it uses the uh, the the, um, the Steam cryptocurrency, and the way it works is that 
when people engage with your video, like when they when they like your video, you get you know you get a little cryptocurrency for that. So it's it's a neat system. Um, it'd be neater if it wasn't as broken as it is. Um, and then pretty soon, I'm actually going to start uploading to a new platform known as um, uh, which is uh, called NextVid.io. It's uh, I'm not exactly sure when it's set to to launch. It it was supposed to set uh, to launch this week. That uh, they might be just working out some 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 technicals, I guess. Uh, but it, it could it could launch any day now, and uh, I'm gonna be pretty ambitious. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to be the first one to uh, to upload on there. I, it's it's a little ambitious, uh, probably not, but I'll give it a try. Um, also, a neat little little fact. I, I have been asking the guy questions, and he's been willing to answer. Uh, that also will be able to auto import your uh, your YouTube videos. I'm not exactly sure how the, he said there would be two ways. So I don't know. Maybe maybe the second way is like you enter the YouTube URL, and it'll start like importing the video. I'd really like that because that's that's an easy way to bring in older videos. Um, so yeah, um, and what's neat about that is that if you have you know, if you already have a Steemit or DTube account, um, you can just use that to log into your uh, your nextfit.io account because it's it's, it's still going to be on the uh, the Steam blockchain. Um, I'm still not 100% how blockchain technology works, by the way. So you know, I'm not exactly a blockchain expert. Um, yeah. So uh, so basically, in short. Um, what I uh, what I'd like people to do is that if you know if you're subscribed to me, um, please subscribe on uh, on all the platforms that I've mentioned. Uh, links will be in the stri- description down below. Um, yeah, I'd really appreciate it if you actually subscribe to all of them and then just watch on whichever one is your you know whichever one is your preference because uh, I mean honestly these days you know with YouTube you, you never know what's going on because like, I mean you know who knows like this 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 downage that happened with YouTube it, it could have been a lot worse. You know, it could have been could have been down for a day, could have been down for a week. You know, could have could have been <laughs> could have been down forever. Who knows? Um, and plus, you, you know, uh, if if I might, you know, go on just a, a little bit of a rant here. Um, you you just can't really trust YouTube anyway. I mean, I I wouldn't trust them as far as I can throw them. The you know they I think I think for people who who used to think that. Uh, that the the bias and the censorious nature of YouTube was just a conspiracy theory. I think most people most people know that that's not just a conspiracy anymore. They're they're, they're wildly biased and they're wildly censorious, which I think is actually quite disgusting. And I think it's I think it's a really really beautiful way of just shooting themselves in the foot um, because you know when they demonetize a creator, they're also effectively demonetizing themselves as well, uh, which is really dumb, really dumb. Um, no, I don't think they should be censoring anything. I mean, aside from any like like actual felonious material, like a, uh, or you know, blatantly copyrighted material, like just you know taking a copy of, you know, you know Deadpool two and uploading it, the whole thing. I mean, obviously, obviously you can't allow for something like that. Um, but uh, yeah, really, really, no, at this point, nobody's channel is safe. You know, and it's it's not just for you know political commentators who are you know voicing controversial uh, uh, you know controversial opinions. They're, it's not just them that are at risk. Everybody's at risk. You know, you you are effectively a competitor to someone else, and uh, you know if that's some big corporation, then they, they don't like that. Um, I mean, I mean for 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 fuck's sakes, even ASMR channels uh, were getting targeted. I'm not sure if they're still getting targeted, but uh, yeah, there were. There were like like ASMR channels that you know had you know big followings and they they were just just dropping off. They were they were getting they were getting censored. Um, you know, I and you know I run I run a gaming channel. You know, I, I um, you know that you know who knows what new piece of TOS or or new thing that had come out that'll end up set you know censoring you know one of our channels or you know end up you know having one of my videos taken down or hell have my old whole channel taken video down. I mean that this video could have this video the. This video could have this channel taken down. Who, like, who fucking knows? Um, you know, there could be some new copyright policy that just just obliterates all gaming channels. I remember, remember, uh, what was it? Um, uh, for for when Destiny Two first came out. Uh, I mean, I don't play that game. I think it sucks. Uh, but you know, when Destiny Two first came out, um, you know, anything that had like the word Destiny or Gun or anything like that in the title, that was getting demonetized. You know, which uh, 
you know, is absolutely a for form of censorship as well. People were saying, oh, you know, demonetization isn't censorship. Yeah, it is. You're taking away the financial, <laughs> you're taking away financial uh, incentive. I mean, imagine if, you know, somebody would just be like, hey, you can still do your job today. We're just not going to pay you for it. Oh, yeah, sure. Okay. Um, yeah, so, I mean, uh, you know, I've... I'm a I'm a free speech absolutist. I, I, you know, I'm, I, anything that's you know not actually illegal or, or you know d you know directly inciting violence, I don't think they should be censoring it. If you if you don't like a certain type of content, then you just shouldn't watch it. That's it's as simple as that, really. Um, but the other reason, uh, one other reason to to you know to start trying out other platforms, you know these other all tech platforms, is you know YouTube doesn't really care about you. They really don't. Um, and they should because, you know, as creators, you are the ones that are generating content for them. Y you are the platform. You, 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 know, you, are essentially, you essentially have built YouTube. We have built YouTube. Because um, with, without any of us, it just wouldn't exist. Um, and now they, you know, they have the algorithm set against newer creators. You know, if, if you're already in, if you're already a big creator on, uh, on YouTube... I mean, you uh, you still run the risk of getting demonetized. Like even PewDiePie gets demonetized. Like he he had to open up a merch store because he was you know wasn't really making much money off of his off of ads anymore. Um. Uh, where where was I going with that? Um, yeah, cause so and like for for newer creators or for people who you know have low subscribe uh, subscribers, like the the algorithm is just against you. It's not set up for you to grow at all, and it's um. You know, and I think that could really be, you know, solved with even just a really simple search feature. Like, all they'd have to do is have something like, uh, you know, like a search filter. You could search by, like, like you can you know, search by popular or search by, like, least popular, you know, you know, ascending or, de a ascending or descending order. So that way you could, you could, you know, for people who want to find, you know, newer creators or, or creators that don't have a huge sub count, you know, that, that you'd have the option to do that. Because some people specifically look for that type of content. They want to find smaller creators. Um, and I think I think that would really be a, um, a smart way for for YouTube to try and, and save themselves a little bit. They should do, they like, they should stop bloody de demonetizing people and they should make a way for newer creators to, uh, uh, to be found. You know, I mean, that's just, that's just smart because you know, all these popular YouTubers, they're eventually going to retire. They're, they're, they're going to stop being YouTubers one day. Then what? Th then what happens? Nobody else is popular. All the popular U uh, YouTubers are gone. So then what do you do? You know, that you know, so they're, they're, you know, they're going to find themselves in real trouble when that day comes. Um, what was I going to say? So, um, basically in short, uh, the, the message from this is don't put all your eggs in one basket. If you are a creator here on YouTube, um, you should branch out and you should upload to well, actually all of them. You should you should upload to you should upload to BitChute. You should upload to BitTube. Uh, you should tr you should try DTube, um, even Daily Motion. Um, I myself am not on Daily Motion, but uh, um, I, if I had more time, I'd pr I'd probably expand a little bit and even upload there. Um, uh, I'm definitely going to be joining Nextfit.io as soon as that comes uh, comes along. Uh, and so, and I think, and I think for, for those, you know, who, who watch people here on YouTube, I, I think you should really, tr you know, try to encourage other creators to, to, to branch out and to come to these, these all tech sites. Um, you know, I think we should be promoting this uh, as much as possible because I really don't like the idea of, you know, YouTube having a monopoly. I don't, I don't like any mon kind of monopoly. So it's, you know, that, that needs to be brought down. That needs, that needs to come to a screeching halt. Um, so yeah, like I said, um, please subscribe to uh, to you know all the platforms that I'm on, and then just watch whatever whichever platform is your favorite. Um, uh, I'm going to put what I think is probably going to be the link to uh, to my next vid.io channel, even though the platform is is technically not out yet. And then when it does come out, I'll just update the link. Um, so yeah, all links will be in the description. And um, yeah, I think I think that about covers my bases. Um, I'll tech for the win.